What's up, Bakugan fans? It's D Hart. I have Bakugan Evolution's Aquos Warrior Whale. Just the core. Gonna open him up. See if he's strong, if he's worth buying. Is he a buy? Is he a hold? Let's find out. I love playing the Bakugan game. The trading card game. I can't push this guy out because his plastic is too tight. And I enjoy opening these up and seeing if they are strong for the trading card game. And he is stuck right now. There he goes. All right, so here's our Orca, our killer whale. I'm assuming that's what he is. Get a good look at him all around. He's got 800 base B power. That's gonna be exciting. These little feet come out, don't they? They do, they come out sideways. So here's a look. Okay, let's find out. Is he worth picking up? Is he gonna help your team win? Is he gonna be lame? Or are you just buying him because you like the design? Two green fists. I'll be darned. If he doesn't have a big green fist bonus, he's gonna stink. Checklist. The gate card is not new and Woo! Bump. Okay, he's gonna get up to 904. Your opponent won't have a core. Uh, that's always strong. To remove your opponent's core is always strong. So your opponent could be tied with you at 900 at that point, or if you're 950, you are up by 50, and you get to remove their core and put it on your side. So that hurts. It would be hard to play against Warrior Whale, I think this makes him a buy. He's worth it. He would be strong on a Bakugan Pro trading card game team. Or if you're playing the toy battling game, I'm not sure how the Green Fists work with that, but um, I'm glad I bought him. I'm glad I have him. This card is cool, actually. His tail in this card. Is that how it's supposed to be? Like that's It's cooler looking than what this tail looks like. That's what I'm trying to say. All right. Thanks for watching. More coming at you soon. Gonna open some Geogon next.